Hello everyone, welcome to this episode of Firefighter Not. Today we're going to be talking about the Beckett Bend, used to join two ropes or a rope to a chain. Uh, pretty easy to tie, um, it's a close cousin to the bowline. So we're going to take rope number one and we just want to make a bite. We want to leave a good tail on it, you know, good 12 inch tail or so, 10 inch tail. We take rope number two, come up through our bite. We're going underneath and then underneath the, uh, the main line. Just like that. Uh, there's your basic Beckett bend. It's real easy to put safeties on this. We just do an overhand knot on each strand. Just like so. Safety is about a finger width apart. I'll show you that one more time. start with a bite of rope on rope number one. We'll take rope number two and we're going to come up through the bite, around, and then back underneath rope number one. Just like that. So this knot is great for uh, joining two ropes of uh, unequal diameter. I have some sterling HTP Ultra here, uh, half inch. Uh, so, for ropes of unequal diameter, we'll just come up through and come around. There we go. Uh, if your rope is slippery and if it wants to slide, we'll pull a little more tail through and we can come around one more time. Uh, for those of you Fire Academy students, only go around once, but uh, you just get a little more grip coming around that second time. We'll call that a double Beckett bend. And lastly, we can join a rope to a chain. Whenever you're joining a rope to a chain, we want to make our bite with the chain just to make things easier. We come up through the bite, come around underneath, and then back under the main line. There we go. There's a Beckett bend uh, using a rope to a chain. Uh, again, it's a Beckett bend or a sheet bend. They're the same thing. So. There's that. There is another neat way to tie the Beckett bend. Very similar to how we tie the snap bull in. What we'll do is we take our rope number one, we make a loop and we pass a bite through from the standing part of the line. We take rope number two and we pass it through that bite. Grab and pull. There we have a snap Beckett bend joining our rope. Works pretty well. So, uh, thanks for dropping by. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and share it with your friends. Uh, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, there's going to be a lot more not craft coming down the pike as we wrap up our Jones and Bartlett. Uh, curriculums, uh, firefighting essentials. Yeah, firefighting essentials. Seven. And firefighter skills, fourth edition. So that's what we're using for the initial part to get through this. So thanks for dropping by, and we'll see you on the next episode.